Okay, so here we have our goodbye scene, and you'll see that the fade time is 30 seconds. That way when you push this, you have enough time at night to get out of the house before all the lights turn off on you. Um, it's early in the morning right now, but I'm gonna go ahead and press goodbye. You'll notice that the music has stopped immediately, and I'm not gonna sit here for the next 30 seconds, but over that period of time, all of the lights will slowly dim a little bit more and more as you go. The shades have already started to drop etc. Okay, I just hit the goodbye scene. You might even be able to see I left my dog Jolene outside. So we need to create a home scene, something that would uh, quickly turn everything back on uh, when you're arriving. So we're going to hit the, oops, sorry about that, the plus button here. We're going to build this scene and we're going to hit shades first. We're going to do kitchen, open, family room, Left and right shades open, master bedroom, the door shade we're gonna keep shut, the windows we're gonna open, guest room we'll leave alone because they're guests. Next, skip. I would make this a shared scene. Custom, we're gonna call this one home. I have no idea why the checkbox isn't working. And then in here you can use a uh, photo that they've provided for you. I don't like these photos a whole lot, um, but uh, I can't take a picture with what's on the wall. That you can do with what's on your phone. So for now, I'm just gonna create something. And we'll use the garage. Okay, then you scroll down here and you'll see home. Now, if you need to add new things, which you will, because all I did was shades, you can go in here and you can uh, hit the plus symbol again, and now you can select lighting. So in this case, um, I'm gonna select the kitchen. We're gonna turn all of those lights on. The family room is connected to the kitchen. So we're gonna turn those on as well. Uh, holiday lights are only plugged in during the holiday, so I'll just leave those on so that when applicable, they will turn on. And then I think there's also going to be a hallway in here that comes from the garage, which is the bonus hallway. So when we're coming home, I want those lights on as well. And the garage, we will go ahead and turn on the main lights as well. All right, we'll hit next, save, and now let's go ahead and activate our scene. And as you're seeing, the lights in the hallway just turned on, the family room are turning on. There goes the shades. And you can see the lights in the kitchen have started to turn on. And it only feels right to let the dog in now. Hi, Jojo. Thanks for watching. Okay, so right now we're watching a movie on the Kaleidoscape system. It's daytime. I have these perforated shades. Uh, they don't black out the room. They're not intended to uh, kind of preserve the view a little bit, um, but it does darken the room up uh, enough for there to be most of the glare off the television. So now let's make a scene uh, for watching a movie during the daytime because I didn't have one of those. Um, this is the way that uh, Savant recommends doing it, having everything preset exactly like you want. And then there is an option in here called fast capture. We're going to capture everything and then we are going to select the rooms that we're interested in this case i'm going to use kitchen and the family room i will hit next next we are going to skip the timer and make it a shared scene custom Movie day should be fine. And then next. Oh, this is my photo thing again. I really don't mind which one we use. We're just going to pick a random one for now. Upload a photo later. And now at the bottom, we have a movie day, movie day sign that we can uh, press when we want to watch a movie. All right, thank you for watching. Uh, these videos are for you, so if they've been helpful, please let me know in the comments and I'll do some more.